So a quick intro here, I have a Celestron Nexstar 127 SLT. As you can see, it is a Mac Cassegrain telescope. And I wanted to get a focal reducer on it because I wanted to get the entire moon in my shots. Uh, and I was able to do that with this focal reducer. I will try to put in some before and after photos from before the focal reducer and after. But essentially, this focal reducer uh, is actually meant for Schmidt Cassegrain telescopes, which have a, a different opening right here. And, and you can't see it, but there's an adapter there. And it's the only reason I was able to attach this to my telescope. Without that adapter in there, it would not have fit. It would have been too, too big. Um, so a quick back reference on this. Um, in order to, for this focal reducer to work, you need 105 millimeters back focus. Uh, I found that through a ton of research online. And this piece right here, plus this, plus the distance between this and my sensor happens to be 105 millimeters. If you don't have a Nikon camera, if you have a Canon, that's fine. The sensor on the Canon, I believe, is a little bit closer to, to everything else here, but the T-ring, the I believe, is like probably a millimeter thicker, so it makes up for it. And either way, I've heard other people say that a millimeter is not gonna make a huge difference. So if you buy, so if you got this focal reducer, you just need to buy this T-adapter, and I will link everything down below. You're gonna need a T-ring, and then the total, when you add all this up, it's going to give you 105 millimeters of back focus. Okay, so if you have a Mac Cassegrain, the mouth right here is going to be different than the Schmidt Cassegrain ones if you have a Celestron. So you need this piece. This is an adapter that you're gonna put onto that little mouth right there. And this adapter is what's going to allow you to connect this guy right here, the focal reducer, because otherwise this won't go on to your, it won't go directly onto your telescope without that adapter. So with the adapter, you're able to connect this. And in addition to linking all the items down below, I am going to link a couple of videos that I got information from in order to make this happen. One is from Garnet Leary, one from Astro Blender. Astro Blender gave me the setup from the focal reducer all the way back to the camera. And uh, Garnet Leary gave me the idea for putting an adapter on the Mac Cassegrain to make the focal reducer work to begin with. So thanks for watching.